Good morning, sir. Today I will present the Institution of Engineers Malaysia, IEM, with my fellow members, which is Shu, Vincent, Gavin, and Terry. So let's start with the first presenter. Hi, everyone. Now I will proceed with the introduction. So, the IEM was established in 1959. So the purpose is to promote and advance the science and profession of engineering in discipline. It is involving of young engineer session and woman engineer session. So it has a total of membership about 45,000 and having a growing rate of 10% per annual. It has 16 technical divisions and four special interest groups. It has also outstanding committees and head by a president and facilitated exchange of information and ideas. This is the profile picture of the president, which is IR On Chin Lum. He is handed the committee of 2021 and 2022. The title of IEN is IEN Connects. So, it is the overlook of the IEN Council 2021 and 2022. So, the president, followed by the party presidents, next by the vice presidents, and followed by honorary, secondary, and honorary treasurer, and different division of the council member, and we representative and young engineers. Next, we see the council member, which is ordinary red, and council member by invitation and the immediate past presidents followed by past presidents and lastly by different state of branch representative next i will invite my teammate to proceed so here is the functions of iem IEM is a society established to promote and advance the science and profession of engineering in any or all its disciplines and to facilitate the exchange of information and ideas related to the engineering. So let's continue. Now I will continue with IEM bylaws. There are 11 IEM bylaws, so every member shall be bound by the constitution, bylaws and regulations of the institution. And every council member shall at all, at all times order his conduct as to uphold the dignity and reputation of his profession and to safeguard the public interest in matters of safety and health and otherwise. So right now, I will just go through roughly about for, for all the 11 IEM bylaws. For one and until four, until the fourth of the bylaws, it is about uh, the taker, the action or unprofessional manner which will be taken if being conducted by any of the IEM members or the council. Next, for the fifth until the ninth bylaws is about uh, the penalties that will be prescribed in section nine point one six or the circumstances leading to imposition of penalty. Next. For the last two bylaws, for the 10th and 11th bylaws, is about the fine or cost that will be imposed under section 9.16, which will be immediately due to irrecoverable recoverable as a civil debt. So that is all from me. I will proceed to the next presenter. Alright, so I'm here to talk about the quotes. Next. So, the title will be the Code of Professional Conduct or meaning Code of Ethics. So, first of all, we must act strictly in the professional matter. Next, not accepting any trades, commissions, or any other profits in the connection of work. We mustn't solicit any advisory or consultative work either directly to the agent or by the agent itself. Next, you should 
not receive any royalty, gratuity, or commission on any copyrights or protected article. So lastly, we shouldn't be not the medium of the payments that might made by the clients on behalf of them to any contractor or business firms. Next, so pass the presenter. Thank you. So now I'm going to talk about the case example. Uh, here's uh, some of the example of past event that have been held by IEM. So the first event was the River of Life ROL project webinar industrial for WRD artificial intelligence innovation half day seminar on engineering aspect of Burj Khalifa lesson learned and beyond one day course on power generation operation steam plant operation uh, and lastly one day course on sustainable development goals SDG 6 clean water and sanitization what we can do so if anyone is interested in IEM event, you may visit this website. Uh, I will put the link at right here. And that's all for our presentation. Thank you.